Hi people, my name is Karen. I'm an anesthesiologist and a mother of three. These videos will chronicle my life. If you were having an operation, you may be given general anesthesia to put you to sleep and keep you free from pain. about 6 45 a.m. and I'm almost at work and just glad that at least I can enjoy minimal traffic going to work today. It's the summertime, all the kids are out of school, so the traffic pattern is much better. Anyway, I'm excited about my day. I have a lot going on. I'll be working with some new residents and um, training them on their first couple days in the OR. So that's always exciting for them. And um, I really like teaching, so I'm, I'm looking forward to imparting some pearls, things that I wish that other people told me when I was starting out so that they can have a better introduction to anesthesia. Um, so we'll see how the day goes and hopefully it's a nice eventless day. So I got a little break between my cases, so I'm going to head down for some coffee, much needed coffee, and take a little breather before my next start. I'm heading over to do another procedure. Um, we're going to be doing a long general anesthetic, so I needed to just prepare mentally for that. Hey guys, so I'm getting ready to do a pretty big case, a general anesthetic. Um, on a patient who's coming down now from our ICU. So I'm just preparing everything I need. It usually takes a little bit of time to check everything and go over all of the medications and make sure everything is drawn up perfectly um, and just being prepared mentally for what we're gonna do today for the, for the patient and for the procedure. Um, so just a great preparation. emergencies in our recovery room that I had to attend to. So I'm feeling a little drained. Um, I'm really happy that I have an abbreviated day today because I had a call last night that was after the usual work hours. So the following day I get out a little early, which is great. I can do a couple of errands, run a couple errands before my kids get home from camp. So I'm looking forward to 
to grocery shopping alone. Yay. <laughs> and then um, maybe a little quiet time before the girls get home. What is hypa, mommy? It's pronounced HIPAA, sweetie. HIPAA stands for the Health Insurance Portability and Accountability Act, and most recently to develop standards and requirements to protect the privacy and security of personal health information. What I'm not going to talk to you about or show here is anything that's specific to patients or patient information. What I am going to talk to you about is life here at work and here at home. I'd like to share with you what it's like to be an anesthesiologist to this place where I'm able to balance work, family, and fun. Yes, I definitely make time for me and my friends. I think it's the most important part of the balance not forgetting to actually take care of yourself. I'll also be giving you guys a view into my experience and the road that I took to become an anesthesiologist and how I even decided to get here. We'll talk a little bit about my day-to-day -day experiences and also go into a little bit about kind of the health facts that have important um, influence on what we do every day and how those things can affect you in other ways as well. So stay tuned and we'll get into it. Here we go. Hey guys, so we are at home, dinner time. So baby already ate dinner. She already had her meal. I'm trying to eat mine and she's reaching for the food. So it's about multitasking, just keeping everything in line. And somebody looks tired. So we're gonna get bath and go to bed and do it all again tomorrow, right? All right, good night. Hey, so I wanted to get your guys' opinion on the format of the videos I produce for YouTube and whether you like this format or the more traditional testimonial. I do this this way because there's a lot of things I cannot say in the live broadcasts that I edit out when I have more time after my shift. While I'm at it, I think providing some humor or theatrical presentation to my everyday boring life will keep you guys interested and inspire a lot of you. Let me know in the comments below. Be sure to like and subscribe.
want to be an anesthesiologist. Great choice.